Okay, well here we are. I've come to the shops again to buy some spam because I want to make a video. So let's go find the spam aisle. Now, not, no, not spam like the stuff you find in your inbox. <laughs> some people are so crazy. This is spam the food. So we've got to try and find spam the food. Now, which aisle would it be in? Hmm, sauces, canned vegetables? I don't know. Let's go down and check. Save a dollar ninety, thirty-three percent off, you beauty! Oh, oh, oh. Okay, now this is where life gets difficult because which one do I get? Bacon, turkey, light, or normal, or fifty percent less sodium? Why can't we just live in Russia where there's like one of everything, and you've got no choice? No, I should move to Russia. Oh. What a great place Russia is. Instead, we got all this variety and I've got no idea which one to choose. I mean, there's this Homel one. I've also got Hamper. i got the Cheap Nasty. Oh, maybe I should get the Cheap Nasty. Although, yeah, anyway. Look, how about... Uh, oh, Hot and Spicy. Oh, I don't know. Which one should I get? Um, standard? Standard. Three bucks. Well, um, what else do I need? Oh, mayonnaise. Let's go and find some. Oh, oh here it is right here. <laughs> it's all in the same lane. How good's that? Okay, so, uh, which, oh, look, we got a lot on special here, which is great. Oh, aioli. Mmm, 420. Uh, no. Okay, let's see how you choose a mayonnaise. Look, Heinz, seriously good? No. <laughs> Heinz, you're not seriously good, so I'm not touching you. Uh, a good mayonnaise is a whole leg. So S and W, that's a pretty good one. Uh, what else? What else? Praise, no, nah, it's too sweet. Uh, Woolworths whole leg mayonnaise, three dollars sixty-nine. Ooh, it's only for a video, so you know I don't want to go too hardcore. This one's all right. Uh, Tommy's really nice, but way out of my price range. So either the four ninety-five whole leg, S W or the whole leg from uh, Woolworths for three sixty nine. dollars It's a dollar something less. It's for a video. I'll get the cheap version. Now I did go and buy some onions, $1.50 a kilo. It's so expensive, but still, I bought some because they're special. And when you're at the shops, what do you do? Go to the chocolate aisle to check out. So let's go check out the chocolate aisle. Okay, so what do we got here? We got chocolates here, 85 cents. 85 cents for all these? No, not touching them. Don't eat cabbage since they changed their recipe and now it's, the recipe's all crap. What else? Um, we got here uh, M&M's, $3. How many? 140 grams? I think, who are they kidding? Seriously, who do you think I am? Uh, M&M's, $3 for 145 grams. You are joking. Uh, what else? We got Darren Lee. Off. Too expensive. No, no. Uh, the bubbly, no, they're usually $2, they're uh, $3, nah. Uh, 2 dollars for a new ducks, nah. 4 25 for lint, are you kidding me? Oh, here we go, half price. Zest of lime lint, $2, but it's only 100 grams, nah. Sorry. Uh, the new Toblerones, which they've screwed up the recipe. And now they're trying to flog them off because no one wants them. Nah, seven bucks. You are kidding me. Half price dairy milk, five dollars. What? That's only 175 grams for five dollars. You are joking. Absolutely joking. Half price chocolates here, nine dollars fifty. For how many grams is that? Five hundred and forty. <laughs> Seriously, chocolate companies. Who do you think we are? You guys are just jokers, and I'm not spending and wasting all that money on your crappy products, so you can forget that. Uh, right, what else is there? Uh, normally, if I was to buy something, I'd just get this cheap, nasty uh, $2.25 for this home brand, same as your Mars or whatever, and that's what I'd be going. But I'm not buying chocolate, I just come to have a look. <laughs> I'm crazy, I know, but that's the way I roll. Okay, look at this. $5, right? $5. 
reduced to $2.50 because it's late in the afternoon. Now, I don't understand these shopping centers. If it's $2.50, why don't they sell it for $3? They're still making profit off that. So why don't they sell that for cheaper and and then um, and then and stop ripping people off in the first place and they wouldn't have all these leftover that they're going to chuck out. What is wrong with supermarkets? You know what's wrong with them? They're just trying to rip you off constantly, all the time. All the time. That's why they make super quick profits, just for their stakeholders so they can buy a new Porsche Carrera. Shareholders, absolute scumbags. Man. Look at this, $3 for these donuts. Reduced to a dollar fifty. Oh no! Why do they do this to me? Why? Why do they? Re oh, and here's a dollar packet of donuts. Oh my God! Two dollars for all these ones. Oh! Why do you do that to me? But I'm not going to buy it because I have strong will, and having strong will sucks, mate. Because I would love to be tucking in to all those donuts all night long. But it's the old waistline, you know. What do you do? Go without. <laughs> Don't you just love this packet of mushrooms? Just look at it. That and look at that. There. With the knob on top. <laughs> I'm a kid, I know. And look at this one. <laughs> Sexy. Something just bit me. Something just bit me and down, saw it, but now I can't find it. Anyway, look what I bought. I ended up buying the donuts. I couldn't resist it. I feel really bad because I hate buying junk food. I never buy it. But I mean, a dollar fifty. How can I resist? <laughs> now I just got to find what bit me and hope it, it's not poisonous. Ooh. If I find it, I'll show you what it is. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.